Hey, what's up? Haven't seen you in a while. Remember me? I'm Gabe. I'm Dennis. And we're gonna be drinking some beers today. Yep. How many times have you drunk a beer, but you don't know how to feel about it? Well, here we are. We're gonna tell you how you feel about it mm -hmm. right now. Exactly. To be a little more specific, we are gonna be doing a blind tasting and judging of these beers. Yep, we got eight lagers. So we're gonna taste them blind, we're gonna ha have a little bit of opinions, we're gonna talk about it, and then we're gonna rank them for you here. Beer me, please. We got beer A. Let's clear the palate. Pop, pop, pop. I so tell me. I took some notes. Some of the things you wanna look for mm -hmm. are aroma, Okay. Flavor, appearance, mm -hmm. mouthfeel, and overall impression. And that's mm -hmm. how we're going to be ranking these beers. Can I give you some aroma techniques? Yeah, give me an aroma technique. All right, this? this is the distant smell. Mm -hmm. So just just try to wave it under your nose, okay. not too close. The problem with going in with your nose yeah. and and sniffing those uh, those aromas mm -hmm. is that you might be taking in too much of the. The, the prominent smells. Oh. With this, you're kind of getting the tail end, some of those oh. aromas that the are lighter hidden, ones. the lighter ones. The lighter ones that you might not, you might not be able to detect. It's too far away. It's too far away, right? <laughs> All right, well, let's get a little closer. You're gonna do what is, the, what is called a bloodhound sniff, like What's a that? dog. It's just okay. like two or three quick sniffs, just. There you go. I'm not getting much. Do we get to drink it now? When's the drinking? There is uh, one more smell test. Okay. Here's another technique. You're gonna cover the top. You're gonna swirl it around a little bit. Trap those aromas in there. Get another sniff, oh, you know? Oh, that's what you did. That's right. If I saw someone do all this with a beer, I'd roll my eyes. Yeah. I. But you're right. It, there's more aromas. There is, right? It is, it is more aromas. You're right. And right, now, let's taste it. do we drink it? No, we no. don't drink it. All right, we damn. taste it. You know, you just want to, you want your tongue to, to uh, you know, you want to cover your tongue with it a little bit. You don't want your tongue to float. You want your mm. tongue to just be a little damp. Oh, that's good. Oh, you just want your tongue to be a little damp. You said. Just a little damp. Oh. This is a nice lager. It doesn't taste like a cheap lager. It doesn't taste like a cheap lager. It's very nice. I, I enjoy this one. Nice, cool, mm -hmm. crisp. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But it's hard to say because it's the first beer and I always like the first beer. First beer tastes like perfume, you it's know? It's like not even fair, right? I know. Right, this is a 44 beer for me. <clears throat> I gave it a 40. Ooh. A 40. <clears throat> you stingy. There we go. <clears throat> All right. Mmm. Thank you. Ooh, also, I'm noticing the appearance already more pale. More pale. Mm hmm. Put your pinky out because you that fancy today. It smells a lot like the last beer. You know what? Still, I like that beer. This tastes German to me. Right off the bat, that, that one tastes German to me. Do you got a total score over there? Yeah, I got a total score. I scored this less than the first beer, mm -hmm. but I like this beer more than I like the other beer. So what? I what does that mean? I want to put this ahead of the beer we had. The number, the numbers are different, man. The numbers are different from the ranking because it's about heart. And my heart says this is a better beer. And I gave this one a 38. I gave this one a 44. 44 I gave this one a 38. 38. So you're going to put it over here. I'm going to put it over here. What do you think? The first one I gave it a 40. This one, I, the second beer, I gave it a 38. Let's go by numbers. We could change yeah. our numbers later. Yeah, we could change our numbers later. We right here. Our numbers here we later. go. Right here, baby. All right, B, fine. Beer C. I'm inhaling mm. so much. I'm gonna fart soon. That's a good beer too. Why are all these beers so good? You swirl it, you get those flavors. It smells like a sticky bar floor. They got a lot of lager on those floors. Yeah. Ooh, this is a little more familiar. This is a little mm. more commercial American lager. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know either. I don't know. I just wanted to say something it's... definitive. <laughs> It's it's definitely a big it's a big brewery though it's a big commercial brewery it's a little sweeter it's sweeter too it's yeah. sweeter and that's what's giving it away that the the commercial brewery sweetness is there mm -hmm. appearance appearance is just like literally the color right I'm probably gonna give the same score for each one the same mm -hmm. number because for appearance of, I think so what do you need like a finger in there what how do you get a bad score on appearance uh. 
Whoa, I got a 30 point beer. I got a 32 30. point beer. You 32. You see, we we both went pretty low on this one though. We both were not impressed. Nope. Not impressed, beer C. You stay there. You deserve to be there. All right. This is beer D. Beer number D. It's got a hop on it. This is a hop lager. Oh yeah. Right? Oh, it's yeah. got a hop. It's got a hop to it. It's got a good bitter fruity. finish. It's fruity. It's that hops, dude. The hops, they 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 dry hopped it. They they spiked it at the end. Very nice. I like it. I like it. I like it. <clears throat> Whew, gosh. Clear the palate, guys. I mean I'm this drunk. This is gonna get uh higher Can't. scores overall. 44. Uh, 45. Uh, yeah, that's... So, uh, that for me is up here. All right, so we're gonna move it up beer, here. Beer D is first place. Yeah, I agree. You gave it a score of 45, I gave no. it a score of 44. Love that beer. Love that beer. All right, we're gonna clear the palate again. Thank you. Pop, 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 pop. All right, we got beer E. Beer number E. Beer number E. <laughs> That's delicious. Aroma, not gonna lie, kind of low. There's like bitterness, mm -hmm. and it's like it's like an old bitter. I'm drunk. I mean, this is now coming down to like personal preference, and personally, I don't prefer this beer. Whoa, flavor, yo, that flavor, off the chain. I love it. I'm giving this a very what, low what? score, 32. This is getting a 32 for me. Uh. 37. This is a 37 for me. Oh. That's a 37? This is a 37 beer. I thought you give it a higher score. It's a 32 for me. Okay, okay. So, so where does it rank? It fits there? right here. E. Yup. There it is. Boom. Oh. We are on number F. Look at this color. An interesting color. This, this is color. different. It's more golden. It's a little bit on the, on the uh, P urine kind of like, oh. You should drink more water side. <coughs> Taste European. Taste European. Ooh. It's got that Euro stink. This is the most serious thing I've done all week. Very carefully judging these beers. Oh, you know another all. aroma technique? Flavor. Flavor. I like it. I like it more than a lot of these others. 39. 35. 35. All right. Okay. F. Beer okay. F goes here. That's the big side, right? Oh, okay. I didn't have to move this one. We got two beers left. Two beers left. Damn. Seventh beer, please. Let's, fla let's flavor this. That's another Korean beer. We got two Korean beers in here. That's a Korean beer. Flavor, empty. Sweetness, a little bit bitter at the end. Like most Koreans I know. Yeah, that's me. That's me. Yeah. I'm going to say it's German and it's Heineken. <gasps> it tastes like Heineken now that you said it. What the fuck? 33, that's pretty low for me. 37. Oh. Yeah. Boom. I love how this is going so far. It's very scientific. This is very different for us. Beer okay. number H, thank beer, you. Last beer number H. Pop, 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 yeah. pop. Going in for the drink. Mmm, but it's got a good mouthfeel. It's very, it's got good head. I like this one. Honestly, this one tastes like a, a, a big commercial brew, but I would say that I enjoy this big commercial brew. It's meh. It's meh. It's meh to it's me. It's meh to you. But I like it. I'll drink it. Hmm. I gave it a 37. Yeah. I gave it a 35. Oh. That's a 72, yeah. which puts it right here. Okay, this is a Jim. preliminary order. Yeah. Okay. How and do you then, feel about that? Oh, uh... We're gonna get these cups refilled. Drink them. And we're gonna reassess our rankings. Are oh. you are you pleased with that? Is that okay with you? All right, we're gonna do that. We're gonna we're gonna clear the table. They're gonna refill these glasses. And we're gonna get back to it. We're back, and the beers have been refilled. And uh, we're gonna reevaluate, right? Uh -huh. We put these in place. I have a couple of second guesses, and I want to re kind of sip and see where we're at. What do you think about that? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I can tell you already off the bat. Uh -huh. The drinkability level has gone up. Yeah, I mean, we've been drinking quite a bit. I want to drink some more. Yeah, let's do it. Is it easier to tell what's worse or is it easier to tell what's better? I don't know. I don't uh, know. Okay, hold on. I'm, I, you just have to start somewhere, so yeah. starting here is not bad. See, I, I still like this beer. I want to go. Wait. 
We have to Titanic. Oh, we got a Titanic. Let's fucking do it. We have a dog as well. Let's put that in there. Now this is what we're gonna do. We're both gonna pour every taste that we do. Right. And we did one taste. We gotta do one pour. So we're doing one pour. Ooh, shit. All right, I'm gonna go from the best to the worst. What? No, you gotta pour in the Titanic. All right, I have to Are pour we it? both gonna pour? No, I think you pour and then, and then I, I we, we taste pour. and then I pour. Drag it out a little bit. Wow, it's still the worst. Still one of the worst beers. Yeah. Right, easily one of the worst beers Ooh, we've I had. I feel bad. Ooh, I don't know what beer this is. It doesn't deserve to be moved up. <laughs> like, nothing about it. It's like so far, telling no. me it's gotta be higher on the list. Okay, yeah. let's just like, keep going. Let's do it, right, let's, let's do go. it. All right. We were too forgiving because it was just right off the bat. We we're so excited to have some beer, <laughs> and then we we're like, "This is like honey. This is so good." Uh, but yeah, to me, that's a lower beer. You see, the I had the first beer like right out the gate. I was so into it. Hmm. See, that's like a second place beer still. All right, beer F. Oh, we ha we haven't played Titanic. Oh shit! Here we go. You pour. I pour. And then I pour, and then we're good. <gasps> Bro. I thought we were taking it slow. I don't Whoa. know, man. There's we. That's, you, you could stretch out that's, these pores. That's like a dick punch. At the gate. <laughs> I couldn't help myself. Here we go. Look right, at you. All right, okay. You're right. There's space. Ooh. Oh no! Oh, it's close. It's close. I grab my beer. You see, that still tastes pretty good. That's pretty European to me. Okay. There we go. Eh. <gasps> that was Dude. literally one drop. Ooh. Watch this. I dare you. Oh. Yeah, we're playing that all night. <laughs> oh, it's uh, obviously a big brew, but I like it. But I'm not gonna go back on what I said. I think that's a Heineken. I still rank these the same, but they're very close. They're very similar beers. Damn. Yeah. Right here, don't fucking watch your elbow, bro. <laughs> fucking watch your elbow. Relax. <laughs> your fucking face and my face is gonna... You see how close he got? It's very fruity. It's very sweet, very fruity sweet. I'd give this a higher score, I think. You can't sneak this by me. But also, you fucking try? this is a craft. Yeah, I put it up here. That was a, that was a little baby stream. <laughs> We have a little add-on. We're going to guess which one is the most expensive beer and which one is the cheapest beer. This uh. is my cheapest beer. The priciest beer is probably this one. Fucking, it's your turn to fucking pour, I think. Is it? Oh, that's a lot of pouring too. Okay, what's that? The cheapest? Uh. Yeah. You know, I don't... Expensivest. I don't know, dude. Let's do the reveal then. I'm excited. Oh, oh, I'm shoot. excited. Okay. All right. What was beer C? Barrio Lager by Thorn Brewing. Sorry, Barrio. Well, sorry. Damn. Thorn my bad. Brewing Company. Shit. Maybe. Oh, damn. We can't say that was Barrio Lager. Is the worst beer. We can't from... say that. That seems. That seems. We haven't thought this through. We didn't think this through. Yeah. Now we're hurting people's feelings. Beer G. What do we got? Budweiser. All right. All right. Woo! We're back on track. We're back on track. Oh, fuck, Barrio Lager. <laughs> a lot of missteps here. Ooh, one drop, Ooh, baby. Finesse. There we go. Beer A, Beechwood Hayabusa Lager. Oh, Beach snap. Beechwood Hayabusa Lager. Beechwood. I gave it the cheapest, baby. Oh, you see? Personal preference, baby. You fucking touched I'm the not touching shit right now. Did you now. touch the table? No, I wasn't. You were the one talking. You Dude, fucking talk I didn't like touch this. The table. That's the problem. Why are you tucking your arm all in right now? Because I'm not. I'm you trying to avoid the table. Like, you don't... All right, I'll drink it. I'll drink it. Oh, gosh. Beachwood. Curveball. You say we. Oh, gosh. I don't know where we're at now. All right, what's that one? All right, all right, all right. What do we got, Gabe? Tell me. Coors. Hey, yo. Hey. All right. It tastes like Coors. It's good though. We normally drink Coors light. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, now that I drink it, it tastes like Coors. Okay, okay. All right, what's the next one? Ooh. Calidad Mexican style beer. Calidad Mexican style beer. That's the curveball. That, oh, you're right, that was, that was. That was the one we were like, oh, that was good. That That's was good, because I got a little bit, yeah. But Mexican style beer, you know what? That makes sense. That's why it's skunky. That's why it's light. Mm. It tastes like a soul. 
Like a soul. I have, I have a soul. I'm, I'm, I'm having a lot of souls with you. Yeah. We've had souls by the bucket. Yeah. If I'm so fucking full, I'm not going to have another sip. This next Just one, run through this, this next one, I called it the most expensive and beer I called on this it table. European. Let's see it. Modelo. Modelo. <laughs> you son of a bitch. Of course. That is the best it beer on the so table. Good. It is so good. I've made my people so proud. <laughs> the third most expensive beer. Wow. Well, this next one, All right, let's this fight. is the one that you call the this most is, expensive. This is what I call, I fucking hope. <laughs> I fucking hope it's not something stupid down there. Kern County Premium. Hey, it's at least a craft. Oh, hey. good goodness. How expensive is Kern County beer? It's not that expensive. <laughs> <laughs> wow, it says it in the name. Yeah. Premium. It's never premium if you have it in the title. That's just a rule uh, of thumb. But it's not about how good it tastes. It's about how expensive it is. <laughs> and you lost that. I for lost sure. that. I lost that. I Beachwood, said Beachwood versus Barrio. I, I think I lost this one for sure. It's the cheapest. Damn. What the fuck? Beachwood is cheaper than Coors? Where the fuck did he buy Coors? Wait, how is Coors more expensive than a craft brew? Next one. Kajara Dry Hop oh, Lager. Oh, thank goodness it's hot. Thank goodness it's hot. Oh, gosh. Wow. The fanciest beer can as well. It had the fanciest beer can? Kajora Most expensive? Dry Hop I was going to go with that, but I just wanted to I just wanted to go the other direction. Wow, I like that. Look at that. Oh my god. Ogo Pogo Brewing. I love it. Is it from Japan? It's in San Gabriel. Okay. All right. I'm sorry. I was, I was so just elated about you know what, you know what transpired. I yeah, forgot yeah. about the winner. No, yeah, 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 yeah. And that is absolutely delicious. Yeah. Pop pop. Pop pop. One, two, three, four. We did it. Thank you, everyone, and thank you for all the beers that we had here. Yeah. Shout out to Adam for getting it together. Thanks for watching, everyone. Follow us on social media. Okay's happy hour. Um, Gabe, what do you have to say? Thanks for watching. That's it. Tell your friends. Yep.